Hello everybody, so this is another, this is part 2 of the playthrough pacifist of uh, Undertale. And, um, yeah, I, I had to go back to it from the leaf pile, save pile, but, I mean not save pile, save file. And so now I'm just back at it again. Um, alright, two of the wax are done. Rock can talk now. What? <laughs> when did rocks start talking? Because this is part of a mountain, right? So, yeah, there are monsters in this place, but like, rocks can talk in a mountain? What? Hello there, partner. Who said you could push me around? Hmm? So you were asking me to move over? Okay, just for you, pumpkin. Hmm? You want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? Wrong way. You may want to go on the, um, the paved tile. And for that, I get punished by a battle of two froggets. Oh no, please no, not this. Oh, nice. Now they finally did it. Okay, let's go ahead and, um... Excuse me. What was that? <laughs> Alright. Oh. I mean, I guess you are rock and you're having to slide yourself down some feet. Oh, here's the safe file. Nice. This cheese has been here quite a long time. It's stuck to the table. Torn. <laughs> Man. Zzz, are they gone yet? They they made a shy ghost. Wow. Oh, this ghost keeps saying Z out loud. Out loud. Repeatedly pretending to sleep. Moving with force? Sure, why not? Okay. Why not? Here comes Napstablook. That is a creative name. I don't know what it means, but it's still a creative name. Act. Hmm. I'll check. He gave Napstablook a. Uh, Oh, really not going up to it right now, sorry. You told Naps to look a little joke. Oh, the attacks are getting easier. I think that might be because of the act. Let me try. Oh, wow, I call it the Dapper Blook. That's a good, that's a good name for it. Naps to look eagerly awaits your response. Um. Oh. Why am I facing away? I usually come to the rooms because there's no one around. But, but today I met someone. Today I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Use 7G in the web shirt, why not? So Spire scrolled down and gave you a door. Spire breaks out. All proceeds go to real spiders. Only that one more life. Um, did you miss it? Spire breaks down into the right. Commit food made by spiders, four spiders of sp Does this support cannibalism of spiders?
What? Okay. Ribbit, ribbit. I heard using borders can add some color to the world. Seems you can choose them in the setting menu before you load your game. However, there isn't a frog theme border, so it's just pointless. Ribbit. Is there? Ribbit, ribbit. I heard you are quite merciful for a human. Surely you know by now, monsters wear a yellow name when you can spare it. What do you think? Very helpful. It is rather helpful. Remember, sparing is just saying you won't fight. Maybe one day, you'll have to do it even if their name isn't yellow. Hello? I just realized that it's been a while since I have cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying about here and there. You can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Um... Someday you might see something you really like. You'll want to leave room in your pockets for that. Flick. Okay. Alrighty. Let me go down here. Oh, nice. Let's go. What does that pineapple looking thing is? I'll, I'll go see. I'm gonna abuse. Did the ribbon. Oh, nice. Oh, wow, that's really creepy. Okay. Oh no, they bounced off the walls. I'm fine. Alright, everything's good. We're fine. Five gold. Nice. Let me go see what that pineapple thing is. I think it's in this one. Yeah, it's in this one. Vegetoid came out of the earth. Vegetoid. I'm gonna say dinner. Fat your stomach. Vegetoid offers a healthy meal. Yeah, I expected that I could spare it if um, I ate the green thing because it just seems like. There's a lever in here, I think. I saw it from like the ribbon, so I think I press it. And now what happens? Oh, nice. Now I can go through. Um, okay. Ready? If you can read this, press the blue switch. I'm assuming that the blue switch is the, um, oh no. I'm assuming that the blue switch is the one behind the pillar. Ready. Oh no. I'm going to spare. And then I'm going to add say dinner. Eat your greens. Alright, nice. Oh. oh, nice. Spare and bam. Good. Wide. A carrot. That's a carrot. Um gave me money no okay this is fine don't be gone all right now we go through oh wow we're increasingly difficult because now i have to I'm gonna go ahead and spare them. Well, okay. Yo, he jamming. Oh, I'm gonna spare it. Two gold. Nice. Oh, I have to. I have to stop. Press the red switch. All right. It's easy. The switch. Press it. Yup. Yeah. Take a guess. Um, dinner. Cool. cool. All right. Spare. Drooped. Drooped out. Nice. Dinner. All right. 
The Pet Your Stomach Vegetoid offers a healthy meal. Eat your greens. Oh no, it's the... Oh, oh no. I have to do it again. Oh, what? And a spare. And now I have to click on the green switch. Is this the green switch? I sure hope so. It is the green switch. Coolio. Um, oh. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna keep walking this way. Okay. Alright. Oh my gosh. Why is she on? Oh. That's a knife. I'm not gonna kill anything on this run. So I don't think I need that. I'm gonna go up this way. Oh dear. That took longer than I thought it would. How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? There. There. I will heal you. I should not have left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try to surprise you like this. Er, well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. Am I small to you? Are you calling me small? Seeing such a cute, tidy house in the woods gives you determination. Mouse hall, home, home. Do you smell that? Surprise, it is a butterscotch cinnamon pie. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here, so I will hold off on snail pie tonight. Here, I have another surprise for you. Okay, you, whatever you say. This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. Is something burning? Um, make yourself at home. Alright, I'll just go ahead and... That the it is that first got cinnamon pie. It it looks like it would taste good. I need to try that in real life sometime. Um, I'm gonna go check out this room. Oh, this is just the kitchen. Okay. We're ready, I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I have I am to have someone here. There's so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I've always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps that isn't very surprising. Still, I'm glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? Uh, when can I go home? What? This, this is your home now. I don't really want to live in a mountain. It's not my ideal spot to live. So, I think I'm gonna try to live above here now, <laughs> instead of in a mountain like I am now. Um, would you like to hear about this book I am reading? It's called 72 Uses for Snails. How about it? How to exit the ruins, because wouldn't that be the exit to the mountain? Uh, how about an, exa uh, an exciting s snail fact? Sorry about that pause. I... Somebody had to tell me something. Did you know that snails sometimes flip their digestive systems as, they're, as they mature? Interesting. How to exit the rooms. I have to do something. Stay here. Actually, I'm going to follow you. That's how I'm going to work. That's just how I'm going to work. go down the stairs. Wow. Why are you here? You wish to re return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I'm going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. No. You called me short. I mean small. 
Every human that falls down here makes, meets the same fate. I have seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. That's dark. They die. You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. I am only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. Okay. This is gonna be a bit of a longer episode. We're gonna make it from 15 minutes to 20 minutes. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. Okay. You want to leave so badly? Hmm. You are just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Oh no. I'm fighting against a goat lady. You cannot think of any conversation. to go home but she stopped attacking me I mean then again she did that a long while ago but like she stopped actually putting the attacks there but please go upstairs now I already told you lady no <laughs> I promise I will take good care of you here I know we do not have much but we can have a good life here why are you making this so difficult please go upstairs Stop trying to convince me. I'm not going to go upstairs. Haha. <laughs> Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save. I cannot save even a single child. No, I understand. You would just be an unhappy trap down here. The rooms are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. Oh. Don't call me small. <laughs> Goodbye, my child. She called me small. I'm running. Alright. Oh. It's this guy again. 
flowy. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's kill or be killed. Too bad. You've been fooled. I kill nobody. So, you were able to play by your own rules. You spared the life of a single person. Hee hee hee. I bet you feel really great. You didn't kill anybody this time. But what will you do if you meet a relentless killer? You'll die and you'll die and you'll die. Until you tire of trying. What will you do then? Will you kill our frustration? Or will you give up entirely on this world? And let me inherit the power to control it. I'm the prince of this world's future. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan isn't regicide. This is so much more interesting. Whoa. Face grow. Okay. Your face can grow. Good to know. Please get out of my way. Bum bum. By Toby Fox. Undertale by, by Toby Fox. Alright, that's all for this episode of Undertale, or part. See you guys later and have a great rest of your day or night. Bye!